Thank you, thank you so very much.
the energy on the stage is electrifying and it's pretty warm up here, as it should be. <laughs> How are you feeling? <laughs> Thank you so much. So after that, uh, Bhoop Rag, we move on to the next one. Uh, it's called The First Thought because this is a piece that's um, the, one of the first compositions of our band. So hope you enjoy. I think it's, it's going to take you to a little bit of um, Hollywood and maybe you can close your eyes and imagine and uh, after, the, after the performance maybe you can come, come up to us and tell us what you felt. Alright, so here goes.
Thank you. Thank you so much. Did that transport you to Hollywood? Thank you. Thank you. And uh, as a visually impaired individual myself and all of us here, we should give you a little audio description, right? Like the, like the way we get in Amazon Prime or Netflix or all the OTT platforms. Up here, we're very all black clothed. <laughs> we're all in black with a waistcoat. So thank you. Thank you so much. And uh, moving on. Moving on, we've got a foot tapping number. Um, okay, basically, let me just um, give you a brief about the first song that we played. Uh, Mr. Kiran, the flautist, he played a classical, uh, Indian classical flute that is Basuri. And the previous piece that we played, he played the concert key flute. So there's a, there's a difference. It, this is the Western flute that you hear in the symphony. And for the next piece, he's going to use another different flute, which I'll get back to you about uh, after the piece. So this is an Indo-Irish theme. Irish is a very good genre, very foot tapping genre. Um, and South Indians can very well relate to that <laughs> because of the groove. And uh, it is paired with a raga called Jinjoti. So here we go.
I hope we <laughs> we took you to Ireland with that. <laughs> so uh, Kiran used a recorder. It's a flute. Uh, it's, a, it's kind of a standing flute. Uh, can can you just play uh, one phrase, Kiranji, on recorder? Yeah. yeah and what what Mr. Yar Rehman composed on this one? But yeah, uh, so a little bit about the artists. Um, all of us here are established uh, in their own right, everybody. Uh, Ritham is from Assam. He's lived in Mumbai for a few years, uh, knows the industry, music industry very well. He's a fantastic music producer, worked on a lot of films, a lot of BGM. And in fact, he's the one who taught me music production as well. <laughs> and. Uh, well, Kiran is now a very well-known face, as you might know. <laughs> he appears on all the reality shows, Indian Idol, Sarigamma, you name it. Uh, oh, did you miss the shooting for this week, Kiran? Uh, uh, yes, I did. <laughs> <laughs> because he loves performing with us. <laughs> so that's, that's it. Uh, and Augustine uh, started off with tabla and dholak and then picked up drums. And he does a very, very good job. Um, and Sachin, Sachin uh, used to sing earlier, in fact, as a backing vocalist and then uh, is very well versed in tabla, dholak, and other percussions as well. So. Yeah, and he is blessed by uh, tabla maestro Ustad Zakir Hussainji. <laughs> yeah. And Mr. Kiran Winkar is also a disciple of Pandit Hari Prasad Chaurasia ji. And uh, a lot of popular themes that you hear are actually played by him, but. Uh, uh, he hasn't, unfortunately, got credit for uh, uh, most of them. Uh, I think one, uh, Kiran, we should do it. So, so the, the, there's a funny anecdote behind uh, this theme. It's a very popular, very uh, famous thing. And it's most of us ringtones as well. So when he travels and uh, at the airport during the security check, you know, people ask, uh, so what do you do for a living? And just then that person's phone rang and he's like, uh, I create such ringtones. Yeah, so, so, so here's a theme that's very well known, but uh, a very, a very few of you might know that this is composed by him. This is his child. So, Kiranji. Thank you. Thank I'm sure you guys know this tune. This is the Krishna theme of the famous Mahabharat serial that, uh, that used to air on Star. Uh, all right, uh, moving on uh, to the next theme. Uh, now, we've not named this theme, <laughs> but we've played it many times. Uh, it is in odd time signatures. Uh, so we know odd and even numbers. So Tal, when it's even number, it's easy to play. When it's odd, it's, it's a little bit tricky, you have to do the math in your mind all the time. Um, so, it will kind of remind you of Yani, because that's where uh, I took the inspiration from. Um, so, yeah, here's the next piece.
One, two, three, four. Thank you. This team was paired with uh, Rag Biplas, uh, which Kiranji played in between. Um, so moving on, moving on to the last piece that we're going to play today. Um, well, <laughs> I can't, you know, I can't hear enough cheers. Did you, are you really liking it? You can be honest. <laughs> are you sure? Give all that you have stored up till now for this last one, okay? So you can, you can sing along, you can groove along, you can actually stand up and enjoy yourselves the way, however you want, right? So let's, let's enjoy freedom, let's enjoy, let's celebrate inclusion. So, so the next piece is uh, based in Rag Des. Um, and there's a lot of syncopation, there's a lot of, uh, okay, I won't reveal the surprises. Let's, let's hear it together.
Thank you so much.